the excellence of the university drew me here, and I'm from this area. As you noticed, there were a lot of Texas Tech grads in the audience, and I'm a Texas Tech grad, grew up in Lubbock. So it just seemed like a match made in heaven. When I came here, I felt right at home. And it's a, it's a larger place than I've come from, close to my family, and it just had everything I needed for the next step in my life. Yes, a lot of it is around some growth and some retention. I think it's important that we continue being a strong liberal arts university, but in Texas today, it's time to grow. A lot of places in the country are losing population to Texas, and we have a lot of work to do to respond to the needs of this population. So I'll be talking to faculty and staff a lot about how we want to grow and where we want to grow, what programs, what ways of delivering those programs, and what places. Because we've got a great campus here in Wichita Falls, but there may be places close by or metropolitan areas where we want to expand. To find out how the things you think about the institution are reflected in reality. So you can come with a lot of presuppositions, and you need to see do those really fit where you've arrived. And the only way to do that is to get out and meet people and talk to them, ask them for their opinion. And the neat thing we're doing is a survey that every single person working here is going to get, and some of our outside supporters as well, to ask them, what opportunities do you see for Midwestern State? State? We just ate all weekend, and we went to a play, and I just have, had no idea that Wichita Falls was such a vibrant place. And I think we're just going to love living in a town this size and this location. I didn't know what to expect. When I interviewed, the whole place was frozen. It was an ice sheet. Every interview that I had was canceled. So I had one little moment when Bob McBroom showed up at the press conference, and that was it. So we didn't see, we, we barely saw Sykes Lake. We saw the Sykes House for a few minutes, but we didn't see much of downtown. My husband's already been out on the bike pass, and he's going to ride in the Hotter Than Hell 100. I love being able to say Hotter Than Hell. It's <laughs> <was> pretty cool. <laughs> so it's just... It's going to be Here fun. Been really friendly. I think there's just, when you have a long-serving president, like President Rogers, who did such a great job, you're really nervous about what's going to take the place, but you're also excited because it's something new. And I think what you were feeling this morning is the excitement of the newness and relief that, well, this looks like a pretty normal person. I think I can get along with her. So there's always some anxiety.